What's up, party people? It's your boy, Voltron Supreme, coming at you again with another Anchor video, and we're going to mention Algorand as well. But today, we're going to introduce a new character, a character inspired by Bob Spade. Bob Spade is superstar viewer. He's always in the channel, leaving comments and ragging on me. But we know he loves the channel. As much as he rags on me, we all know he loves the channel because he's always one of the first ones to leave a comment. So we're going to introduce... A new character for today inspired by Bob Spade himself so let's begin it's your host with the most Rico Suave so we're gonna talk about crypto.com we're gonna talk about anchor and is Algorand also involved let's take a look something strange has been happening recently I've noticed that you know there used to be a time where you can go to the anchor website at the bottom of the page if you want to see the price of the token it would say powered by anchor and on some of their partner sites, you know, some of the partners, they would do the same thing. You'd see a little badge on the bottom would say powered by Anchor, but it's gone. When I went to the Telegram group, if you wanted to check the price, you would, you know, you would do the slash P and then the Rose bot on the Telegram group would give you the price. But now if you do that on the Telegram group, it says crypto.com, a crow bot. When you go to the Anchor website, it's been replaced with PoweredByCrypto.com. So is something being brewed in the background? Is Crypto.com just marketing via Anchor, or is there something else going on? Crypto.com, we know, is growing. It's growing, you know, fast. You know, it wants to be the number one exchange in the USA. You know, they got the stadium. You know, they're, they're, they're advertising a great deal on TV. They're letting the world know that, hey, we are here. When you go to the crypto.com site, you start to see that, hey, you know, they have a separate exchange for high net wealth, wealth people, you know, where they can invest in derivatives. One of those derivatives is an anchor derivative. And they also have an Algorand. And we know Anchor is moving towards DeFi. They're pushing the DeFi a little more than they were in the past. So could they have been in talks about creating these derivatives? Have they been in talks with Algorand? Because, you know, they have an Algorand derivative and Algorand's the future of finance. So something is brewing there. And, you know, it's a glimpse of what's coming down the pipes, you know. The future looks bright for both Anchor and Algorand, but we got to keep looking at this at this at this move. See if if there's something there. Anyway, guys, I'm not affiliated with Algorand, Anchor, or Crypto.com. Always do your own due diligence. Until next time, peace out, and talk to you later.